Well, good morning, everyone. Welcome to Daily Office. Um, like I said, what are we going to do on Friday? We celebrate. So, hey, it's Friday. Say, woo, it's Friday! I'm waiting. Okay, thank you. All right. So today, we're going to round out um, our divisible by five psalms, um, and we're going to be in Psalm 40 today. So Psalm 40 reads, I wait patiently for the Lord. He turned to me and heard my cry. He lifted me out of the slimy pit, out of the mud and the mire. He set my feet on a rock and gave me a firm place to stand. He put a new song in my mouth, a hymn of praise to our God. Many will see and fear and put their trust in the Lord. Blessed is the man who makes the Lord his trust, who does not look to the proud, to those who turn aside uh, to false gods. Many, O Lord my God, are the wonders you have done. The things you planned for us, no one can recount to you. Were, were I to speak and to tell of them, they would be too many to declare. Way too many. Sacrifice and offering you did not desire, but my ears you have pierced. Burnt offerings and sin offerings you did not require. Then I said, Here I am. Here I, ca I have come. It is written about me and in the scroll. I desire to do your will. O oh my God, your law is within my heart. I proclaim righteousness in the great assembly. I do not seal my lips. As you know, O oh Lord, I do not hide your righteousness in my heart. I speak of your faithfulness and salvation. I do not conceal your love. In your truth from the great assembly do not withhold your mercy from me O Lord may your love and your truth always protect me for the troubles without number surround me my sins have overtaken me and I cannot see they are more than the hairs of my head and if you haven't seen me I've got a lot of hairs on my head sorry guys I know you're jealous but I got a lot of hairs that's okay and my heart fails within me. Be pleased, O Lord, to save me. O Lord, come quickly to help me. May all who seek to take my life be put to shame and confusion. May all do who desire to ruin, who desire my ruin, be turned back in disgrace. May those who say to me, aha, aha, may they be appalled at their own shame. But may all who seek you rejoice and be glad in you. May those who love your salvation always say, The Lord be exalted. Yet I am poor and needy. May the Lord think of me. You are my help and my deliverer. Oh my God, do not delay. Come quick. This is the word of God for the people of God. Let's all say thanks be to God. So this psalm is a little bit more upbeat than yesterday. Um, David was looking for help, right? Um, all my hope, all, all, all of his hope was in Jesus. All of his hope was in God. Um, he was looking for help. And it appears that in Psalm 40, uh, David got that help. Um, it says, and he waited patiently for the Lord. And the Lord turned to him and heard his cry. Lifted him out of the slimy pit, out of the mud and the mire. He set my feet on a rock. Picked him up, put him on dry land, popped him down, said, guess what? You're my son, and you're saved. All I did was ask. That's kind of the theme for the week, right? If you need help, ask. If you need forgiveness, ask. If you need something from God, ask. It's kind of there. It's kind of what it's meant for. It's kind of unconditional. Um, that's kind of what God's all about. 
case you didn't know, the ten, um, ten things that I, what is the ten, the ten things that I said yesterday. Um, as long as you follow those ten things, the suggestions or whatever the uh, the requirements or whatever they're called, um, as long as you follow those things, right, then you'll be good. Um, ask for help and you'll get it. It's pretty evident in Psalm 40 here. Um, David asked for help in Psalm 39 and Psalm 40, God come through, picked him up, put him on the dry land. It's really simple. And David appears to be praising him throughout this. And he says, he says, look, all this stuff is going around me, but I don't really care because I've got you for me. I've got you there with me. Um, all the help that I asked for, everything that I ever desired, you gave to me and you didn't require anything of me. Uh, you didn't require anything in return. It's the definition, the textbook, I guess, the textbook definition of unconditional love. Um, and that's, that's a beautiful thing. It's a very beautiful thing. Um, so, uh, what else can I say except for <laughs> the theme of the week is ask for help. And if you need it, you're going to get it. No matter who it's coming from, someone will be there. If you ask God, God will help you. If you ask me, I'll, I'll help you. That's, that's fine. Let me know. If you need prayer, if you need anything like that, I'd be glad to be there for you. That's all we got. Happy Friday. Will you all pray with me, please? Lord, thank you for being with us this week and all of our days and as we go throughout the rest of the uncharted lands that we call time and all the land out there. Um, we want to pray that you'll be with us, uh, that you'll guide us, that you'll help us to know that if we need help, even though there may be dark times, the dark times may be plenty, you're still there with us and the help will come no matter what the circumstance. The help will come. Well, happy Friday, everybody. Uh, thank you so much for joining us on Daily Office this week. Um, sorry Kurt couldn't be here for the rest of the week, but you know, like I said, he's still not doing the greatest. He's getting a lot better. So put your uh, put your prayers down in there for Pastor Kurt down in the comments. Share this so we all know that, that you guys are watching it, so that we all know, or the, so that he knows that you guys are all praying for him. Um, do what you can. Uh, send him a card, send him a text, something like that. So. Um, we want to thank you so much for joining us this week. We want to thank uh, uh, the Marks again for helping us out. They're doing such a great job on that. I'm going to try to continue to ask them more. I'm going to try to talk them into it. Um, so we're going to get that going. And uh, hopefully we'll see you guys again on Monday. Um, and we're going to, going to keep on chugging along with the Psalms. We'll probably be in Psalm 41. So um, we'll get to it. It's right there. I won't forget about it. All righty. I don't have a hat on. I would twist it around and stuff like that. But I wanted to reveal my... Malicious locks. Should probably cut that out. That's okay. Have a great day, guys. God bless, and we'll see you on Monday.